Okay. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Danny B. You feel me? But today we are coming to y'all with a special guest. My sis, my blood sis, y'all. I call her sis, but she gonna tell you what her name is on here. <laughs> hey, y'all. This is Aminette L. Bay. See, I, I was not going to get that. So I said it's just sis. Okay, y'all. Okay. <laughs> Tonight, y'all, it's about sisters. It's about women empowerment. This is what this is about, y'all. So, of course, it's always about the culture that surrounds you, the culture that affects you. And today, we're going to be talking about the women. Yeah. African women, all cultures. We're going to be talking about it tonight. Okay. So, sis, let's talk about us first because we're sisters. I'm 43. You are? I'm 38. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. <laughs> let's just say we wasn't always the sisterly, just, oh, my God, that's my sister. I love my sis. You know what I'm saying? We had that love-hate relationship all the time when we was growing yep. up and, you know, all those things. So, we kind of grown out of that and and really have tried to mend. And it's crazy the thing is, is that I think what we disliked about each other or just was upset about was just something dumb and we just let it ride because we yeah. didn't want to be, okay, I'm, I'm not going to be the bigger person. I'm going to not go apologize. I'm not going to do this. Yeah. So we just going to not talk to each other, just deal with it, whatever the case. But I think yeah. we've learned from that. We've grown from that. And now it's like we talk to each other. If it ain't every day, it's every other day at least. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. <laughs> right? Yep. That's true. That's true. I mean, having a sister is hard yeah. when you're living together. You know, we bump heads all the time, but I mean, you're sisters. So you can't not communicate with your sister. So, you know, now we're communicating times where like, different now right. we're getting older we're you know what i'm saying we're getting too old for the stupid games and all that other bs that you know sisters have right. and now it's just moving forward and just building a stronger bond and a stronger relationship with my sister i mean exactly. we've got another sister and we've been spending more time together you know trying to do sister dates every other couple weeks when we can and just to get out there and do things with our right. sisters because family is everything, you know? Hey, I agree. I agree. Cause it'd be times that we could be texting each other and I know I can probably piss you off. Cause you'd be like, whatever, Danielle, bye. And I just be like, whatever. <laughs> like, all right, we'll be talking tomorrow. It's yeah, all good. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. That's just how we are. But you yeah. know, for, for all women that got sisters, man, love on y'all sisters, y'all. And like, I don't care what we do to each other, still come back and try to mend that love and that relationship because it ain't nothing like sisters sticking together through thick and thin at all times. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that was that. But I also wanted to talk to you, sis, because, you know, as us being black women, um, I think the thing is that, you know, when we be in public or like I had a situation and, you know, I called a girl queen. I was like, oh, queen, you look nice. She looked at me with that look like, you know, and I'm just like, whoa, it's not that serious, queen. It's not that serious. Mm -hmm. And I don't know what it is of why <laughs> women have to hate on each other. And that's crazy is because we should all come together. It don't matter what color you are. You should come mm -hmm. together because we are women. We have to stand together and fight against a lot of things together. But for mm -hmm. another woman to call you queen, no, I'm not gay. No, I'm not looking mm -hmm. at you in a sexual way. I'm mm -hmm. just telling you, you beautiful queen, because maybe a man didn't tell you that today. But hey, as your sister, I'm going to tell you that today. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So like, I've you know, that. with that, with that and that mindset, there's a lot of people that are so young minded. Sis. Yeah. So we can't expect it. We can't expect everyone to have that same mindset because right. we still got babies. That's in the babe they they got that baby mindset they're they're not thinking oh i'm a queen oh she she must be gay because she called me a queen but you know it is what it is you know what i'm saying and a lot of people are not going to understand that because they're not older they haven't right. matured and that's right. that's the thing we still it's still kids that are 20 years old 
even 30, 30 years old, my age, that, that's still like looking at you like a queen, like, oh my gosh, she must be gay. No, that's not, that's not what it is. We're right. trying to have a, a bond together as, as women, you know, and, and just us being black women. Black women, me, me and my husband, we were walking in the park, you know what I'm saying? And and for him to say something to the guy and not say nothing, same shit. For me to look at the girl, you know, hey, and she'd look at me like I got, you know, poop in my face. Same, same thing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It is crazy. It's crazy how the times are. Everybody wants, you know, us to stick together, but how can we stick together? You you got one person that's doing one thing and one person doing another. It's, it's kind of hard to to stick together when that person is looking at you like you crazy. Right. So, but it is what it is. Everybody's not going to be on the same page. Everybody's not going to want to grow. Everybody's not going to have that mindset to want to to grow, even if they were like that in the past. Change, change right. is always good. It's not. It's never bad to change. Especially being sisters, like you said, we've been through a lot, and I love you so much. Like that's just the the love that I have for my family, and that's just me. Right. But everybody's not going to be that way, and everybody has their own opinions. So everybody might not think the way that we're thinking. Right? They may have a different relationship as their sister. You know, they may hate the hell out of their sister, and you know, it is what it is, and it shouldn't be that way. I feel like we're family. And family should always stick together, right. no matter what. But everybody's not going to be on that same level. All right. So then let me ask you. So do you think it starts in the household? Because I'll tell you this, like how I'm raising my daughters is totally different than how we were raised coming up. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody mm -hmm. choose to, you know, want to raise their kids a little bit different than what their parents did and, and certain, just yeah. certain ramifications, just certain things. But yeah, if your mother is not showing you how a queen should act and be, how do you expect that person to learn? If you mm -hmm. didn't have a father in the house that treated your mother like a queen, how do you expect a woman to react when you are being called a queen? Mm -hmm. Because you don't know. And some women don't know to this day you know, how they should be, or, you know, I, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I'm like in the dating field and I've been, you know, trying to go out on dates, but I'm very picky. So now I'm like, if he can't even call me queen, I'm like, well, hell, I want to make sure my daughters know, Hey, we are Queens in this house. So I mm -hmm. want to be addressed as such, just like he should be addressed as a King. Mm hmm so that you want that you want to make sure your kids know that even your daughters like no we don't want them to be all like in their head like oh my god i'm a queen you need to do this and you need to do that no yeah we're not saying that but just know that everything that you deserve and want from life man relationship whatever it may be you may have that but you mm -hmm. have to act a certain way you got to carry yourself a certain way so to carry yourself like a queen you're going to attract the right person Carry yeah. yourself like a thought. You're going to attract what you get. Uh -huh. So when yeah, we say true. queen, that means, woman, you are beautiful. Sis, I love the fuck out of you. Yeah, we have been through all kinds of shit. But I love you, too. I don't know if I'm willing to die for you yet. <laughs> I had to think about that. I was like, well, wait a minute. Okay, I'm going to die for my sister. But I'm, I'm uh, you know... <clears throat> Okay, hold on. You know what I'm saying? Really? <laughs> you know I'm saying. Come on, y'all. That's cold. I uh, see you. I'm saying you. But you know what I'm saying? It's like, it's a lot. And it's the same thing for men. So, if fellas, y'all mm -hmm. watching this too, I'm telling you, it's nothing wrong with a man saying, What's up, man? Bruh, I like your shirt. Yeah, man, I like your shirt, yeah. homie. Like, damn, that, exactly. that should look nice on you, though, homie. Yeah. Ain't nothing wrong with that. There's nothing nope. wrong with that. It's not saying that nope. he's gay. It does not say that he's nope. bisexual. It's just saying that's nope. a king announcing another king that, hey, man, I like how you dress and you dress in shop today. Yeah. There's nothing yep. wrong with that. And if you yeah. feel intimidated by another man saying what he got to say, you are uncomfortable in your own skin. Yeah. 
Because, see, I'm comfortable yeah. in mine. Yeah. She can call me sexy, hot. She can call me everything. Hell, I might look at her like, mm, but I'm just yeah. saying. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm just saying. You, you know how I am. I don't care. Women are attractive to me. They are sexy creatures. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It just depends mm -hmm. on if you open your mouth or come out if it's nasty. You just be like, ugh, unattractive. Mm -hmm. But yeah, you know. yeah. Yeah. And going back to what you're saying, growing up, how we grew up in a house. Right. I mean, just because just because you grew up in a house and you weren't taught that way <clears throat> doesn't necessarily mean that that's how you have to raise your kids. Mm -hmm. That when you come out of the house, that doesn't mean that you have to still keep that mindset. Because, I mean, at the end of the day, when you when you come out of the house, you're going to realize, OK, that wasn't right. Right. You you have a choice. You have a choice to stay that way. And this is just my opinion, and everyone has their own opinion. Um, right. you know, leave a comment, you guys uh comment in the in this in the description box and let us know, ask some questions about um who's wrong, who's right. What what do you guys think? What are what are you guys' um what do you guys think about what we're talking about right now? You know right. what I'm saying? Um, everyone has a choice. So it's it's a choice that you want to continue to think okay i was raised this way I, this is the only way that i can be no it's it's totally not true you have so many options you can go get therapy if you feel like you need therapy black people get therapy Period. counseling if you need to yeah of course meditate that helps i meditate it helps breathing exercises mm -hmm. it helps <laughs> be right back Okay, be, be back, back. y'all. <laughs> Alrighty. So back to that. We were talking about just uh friendships, relationships. We're talking about sisterhood. We're talking about just bringing everybody together, especially as African Americans. Uh, we're talking about all ethnicities, actually. Um, sistership, brothership, brotherhood, however you say that. Um we don't have to be mean to each other. Mm -hmm. Like, just like how you said, sis, when you see someone, hey, queen, how you doing? You know, I've I've had that a lot. Hey, queen, girl, you looking good? Oh, don't tell somebody, some somebody that they think they look good. That, uh, have you ever seen that face, sis? Yes. Like, really? Did you just say it's that horrible. to me? It's horrible. Some it people is. are, hey, girl. When they say that back, like, I, man, you know, I feel so good. I'm like, okay, uh, you know, I feel that bond, to, you know what I'm saying? Right, because we don't, ha it doesn't have to be a man to say, hey, oh, you look good. Why can't it be our own, our own women? You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, for real, say that to me. This is what I want y'all to do on this live, y'all. Get a, get a home, girl. Get you, obtain a new home girl, girlfriend, whatever you want. Y'all go hang out, bar, whatever the case. Meet somebody new. Learn that person. Learn that culture or, or do something else because that's what we need. We need to stick together. Create mm -hmm. those bonds where you can do whatever y'all want to do in the world, man. And I'm just being so mm -hmm. honest. Like It is such a blessing to get to know other women. And I love that. I I I mm -hmm. I welcome it with me. So comment below. Let's be friends. Let's yeah. let's get in there. You know what I'm saying? Let's go out. Let's mm -hmm. hang out and get to know each other because that's what we need. Let's all yeah. stick together and stop hating on each other and stop doing all. I mean, it, it's not even that necessary. It really is not. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, what did you gain from that? Looking me up and down. Mm -hmm. What did you gain from that? And another right. thing. Stop thinking that we want y'all men. Like, I swear, yeah. 
I went into the I went into this a little restaurant. Okay. I was looking good though. I was fly. He did look at me. He I was fly. But let me tell you something. Boo boo. You didn't have to hold on to your man extra tight. Because if he didn't want to be taken, he ain't gonna go nowhere. But for you to hold on to him extra tight, <laughs> let me know already. Y'all had some kind of problems and you are already yeah. insecure. Okay. Yeah. So that that's already an issue. We can get into that on another time, but I'm just saying, like, for real, we don't want your man. I no. say I don't. I can't speak for everybody in the whole wide world. But yeah, I'm gonna tell you, I'm looking for somebody that's single, not in a relationship, not married. I don't do all that. So yeah. <laughs> Me, Danny, we we're not gonna go there, okay? <laughs> but yeah, yes, 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 yes. So and 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 for the sisters who, I've had another friend of mine. A friend of mine does not talk to her sister at all. She hasn't talked to her sister in years, and I just feel so bad because I tried to say, okay, well, what did she do? Like, is it that serious for like so many years gone, and y'all not gonna talk to each other at all? She was mm -hmm. like, nah, and I was like, you need to rekindle that. You really do. Because you kick it with me more than you would kick it with your sister. I mean, I love the attention. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, rebuild that. Because there's nothing that bad that should hinder you from talking to your sister. You know yeah. what I'm saying? The crazy thing is, life is too short. You know what I'm saying? Nobody knows when, when we're going to go. You, you can go in your sleep. Any, any, anything is possible. You know what I'm saying? Right. You never know. And, and just because they, they're not talking now, if she lost her sister, God forbid, how guilty would she feel about that? Mm -hmm. How would that make her feel? Oh, I didn't talk to my sister for something that was some, some BS that we could have just got over with how we did. You right. know what I'm saying? It was, we swept that shit under the rug. Like it was just stupid, stupid things that was unnecessary. You know yeah. what I'm saying? You, you're supposed to love your family. The family, your family is all you have. That's your blood. That's all that you have. And and just to think to lose your sister or lose, you know, a brother to a brother, what can you do uh, over something so stupid? So you sweet. know, it's, it sucks. And, and if there was just so much love in the world, I mean, I guess, which that will probably never happen, but I wish it was. <laughs> Man, everybody would be just amazing. Like I, like yeah. you said, I want to be with the girls. Like I want to not feel like, oh, she's shady as hell. I don't want to be with her. You know, I don't want to yeah. hang around her. I gotta. I literally have a handful of friends. That's it. That's all I need. Yeah. And my sister. So you know, I feel yeah. like yeah. Same thing. They didn't even make yeah, it to exactly. five. It didn't even make it to five, sis. Yeah. It didn't even make it to I'm five. Probably, and that's not even counting my sister. So I I'm said, like, I'm not your five, baby. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's that was it. That was it. You know, uh, you, you oh, we have associates. We have associates, right? We, have associates. we, we associate yeah. ourselves with people, but friends, it's really minimal. Why? Because we just don't have time for the bullshit. Like we 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 too mm -hmm. old to be playing the game of of all yeah. the shit that goes on in the friendship. Like we don't, I don't have time for that. Yeah. If I figure yeah. your goals, if you still doing the same shit and you ain't really going nowhere. Like I try to evolve my circle around successful people. Mm -hmm. If you still hanging with the homies in the hood and doing all that other crap, dismiss me. We're not going to work yeah. out. We are not going to be that person. If you still throwing up the blood and crip signs and doing what you do, boo boo. We ain't going to never kick it. So yeah. just go ahead and dismiss that theory too. You know what I'm saying? Because I, 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 I've it's never. Time to grow. Huh? It's time to grow up. It is. It's like, when are you going to grow up? You got yeah. still in their 40s, still gang banging. It's like, for real? I thought gang banging yeah. was done when I was in high school. Like, like bread. That was 20 plus years ago. And we still doing it? Like, we still rolling yeah. that trend, tradition over, huh? Just, just keep rolling it over, huh? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's not sexy. It ain't cute. The only thing you're going to attract is a whole thought. That's it. Y'all yeah. deserve each other. That's it. Yeah. Ain't nothing yeah. else coming to that. Because I tell you, ain't no, just, and it's the same thing because you got women that are 
And I'll be honest, you got women that are game bangers too. Yeah, you do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But some some men don't want a game banger, just like women don't want a, a, a gang banger. For what? Yeah. I ain't mm -hmm. trying to die. Yeah. I don't need nobody pulling up saying bang, 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 just to get you yeah. and they killed everybody else. Everybody no, else. it's okay. Mm -mm. I don't want to be in the wrong mm -hmm. place at the wrong motherfucking time, or I could be at the right place because I probably wanted some chicken or something. And something else happened because I was there at the wrong motherfucking time, like you know, a quarter of a yeah, of a quarter of that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. It's true. It's true. I, I man, I I just I just hope that everybody understand that what we're trying to get the message across that we need to stick together more. I mean, there's so many things that has happened as far as, you know, with our culture, black people with, you know, violence and uh, police brutalities and things like that. And, you know, we're not even trying to stick together, but we're trying to, you know, have riots and, and shit like that. Like, I, I just don't understand. Like, we, we all need to be on one accord, whether it's Black men with Black men, you know, women and women, like, even if it's Asian and Asian, Black and Black, uh, white and white, yeah. it's, it's all ethnicities. Everybody needs to stick together. Especially, you know, with our people, black people, uh, we need to stick together. How can we stick together when there's so many fatalities going on? You know, we got black people killing black people, but then you want to riot over a police brutality. That doesn't make sense to me. You know mm. what I'm saying? So it's kind of it's kind of a little backwards, but I think we're gonna figure it out. We're getting it together. I and think everything was backwards when crisscross came out and they made us jump, jump. That's <laughs> a, that's when that happened. That's when that happens. <laughs> I'm so done with you, bro. Like I'm so done. <laughs> you know that that actually was I, I liked I liked them. Okay. Jump, jump. Yes. I, I went okay. to school with clothes backwards because of them. You know what I'm saying? That's how that, that group started. was that's how, dope. That's how I started in school. Was it, it, that, that group was dope. Don't be hating, okay? Don't be hating. And yeah. okay, Ooh, I'm Tevin Cross. Campbell era here. I'm Tevin Campbell. I, era I know Tevin Campbell was, yeah, he was good too. Yes, yes, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, you yeah. Know. So, all the all <laughs> queens, look, check it out, y'all. Vibe with us, stick with us. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see our cash app is going down there. Support this family. That is my blood sister, y'all. You already know my brother. He He's not, of course, he's not going to be here. He don't want to be in with the women stuff because we're going to make him feel so uncomfortable. But yeah, <laughs> you, you see my look? Uncomfortable. uncomfortable. <laughs> So, but he'll be back for the next one, y'all. He'll be back for the next one. He probably gonna have some laughs and giggles because this is the first time that me and my sister did this. But um, all in all, definitely support women of all cultures. Because let me tell you something. I should not have more white friends, Hispanic friends, no other color of a friend on my hand than my own culture. Mm -hmm. Okay, that is a big problem in our community. If I have way more friends of different cultures and not my own, that's a problem. Right. We are all not going to get along. We are not going to yeah. all have the same opinions. May it be politics, may it be whatever it may be. We are not yeah. going to get along in that. That's just like a relationship. You can't expect somebody to be on your whole accord to be a Democrat or, or a Republican or do this and do that. or do. You, you just can't do that. The no. relationship will just go to whole shit right. because you can't be your own person. So no, yeah. I want you to be your own person. But at the same yeah. time, we just got a vibe. We got to connect mm -hmm. on something. Exactly. But don't dismiss us real quick, sis. Don't dismiss yep. it. That's all we saying. What about yep. you, sis? Everybody is not your enemy. Mm. That's what I got to say about that, sis. So make sure y'all follow us on Instagram. Y'all already know our YouTube, your, our YouTube channel, our TikTok channel. If you have any questions, definitely hit us up. 
All right. And comment that, below. Yeah. If y'all like this and y'all want to see the sisters again together, like this one. Comment. Like, say, bring comment. the sisters back so my brother can bring Bye. us back in full effect. You feel me? Okay. Culture Gang. Remember that merch, y'all. Culturegang.com. All right. We Go got check out that there. merch, y'all. Period. We out of here, y'all. Peace out.